Hello, this is Crafty Crafty, and today we are doing Crafty Permacraft. What is Crafty Permacraft? It's actually just Terra Permacraft. It's me playing. Okay, uh, this series is a bit different for uh, compared to my previous Crafty Permacraft series because first, it's not in Turkish. Second. It has other modes than Terraforming Craft. Okay. This aside, what is Terraforming Craft? For who doesn't know that, it's a total conversion mod that focuses on more of a realistic approach of uh, to Minecraft. More of a you start in a Stone Age kind of way and you slide slowly progress you get what you need etc etc uh one of the first things that change is you can't you literally cannot uh break trees with punching you need to create an axe but how can you create an axe without getting trees it's simple you get rocks uh, those th these rocks from ground and you right click then you have this screen you start napping and voila you have an axe head and now i have an axe That's it. <laughs> now I can start shopping. And you see something strange. I'm chopping from bottom. And three holes. Yes. Sorry, Permacraft works like that. Uh, I also have an extension. Um, some other mods. One of them is uh, dynamic trees. It I actually add for the visual part because trees grow more granularly and they fall kind of majestically. And so I like it. I like it. Uh, the mod pack itself is actually not my design. It's actually a mod modified version of. Um, my cat decides to play with his toy. <laughs> it's my oldest cat, Pachi. Okay. First, we need to survive. Okay. I created that next. Now what? I need to create a shovel. And... Not this. Yeah. Knives and holes. Yes. Okay. Let's create our knife. I actually kind of debated that should I use a modpack grid? Uh, if you hear rattling noises, my Cat decides to decides to he she needs to zoom around the room, and she's usually a quiet cat. Okay, uh, the mod pack itself is actually auto therapy craft. It's oh, I found malachite. Let's let's. Uh, save this. Okay, uh, first I need oh, uh, water source. That's good because we need water. Because terraforming craft requires you to requires you to drink water. Okay, I think this place is might be good starting point. Uh, knife, come here. Yes, I need those trolls a bit. 
and oh, nice onions. I feel like straight now. Okay. Uh, by the way, you will hear a lot of bad jokes from me, so be prepared. Uh, okay. Now, my first house will be. Actually, I just need a small tent kind of thing, so it's just going to be this. Just to hold the monsters to get to me. And I, because I don't want to die instantly. <laughs> okay. First thing first. And my knife is about to break. Race, yes. Okay. Now, let's look at, at our book and fire pit. We need to first create a fire st starter. And then, need one log, three sticks, and. Okay, let's create our first fire starter. And let's plant our guys. We need you too. Let's make some arsenic. Okay. One, two, three, one, and. Well that I started to fire. And let's create some sticks. And <laughs> uh, not sticks, the torches. And then Okay. Where wa was I? Yeah, yes. What is the mod pack? Mod pack is auto tear for crafts, but it's heavily modified. Auto Terraforma Craft is actually quite simple uh, for a mod pack, and I actually just need the technical aspect of it. I just wanted uh, Terraforma Craft and Crate for the technical aspect. I didn't want anything elaborate uh, for it. So it was a good start. I kind of debated that should I work with. Uh, things like quest books but i it's not necessary uh the only thing quest books will help is kind of guide me and show me the crate but i can learn it i did it for years and it's getting dark let's light the area and survive our first night And another log, and that's it. Yes, I think I am safe for now. Okay. Uh, you you might think I need need to create a, a craft a crafting station, crafting table, but if you look at the recipe. I can't see it. What is the recipe for crafting table? Actually, I think it's broken. Yeah, it might be broken. Uh, no. I think I might broke something while uh, doing tweaks to the pack. But let me check. Okay, uh, first thing first. First things first. Uh, who am I? I am Kirtis Kirte. I'm a Turkish YouTuber. I kind of ramble a lot. I usually do things like Greg Tech. 
and the Linux and open source stuff. And I decide to create a uh, YouTube channel that focuses on same content, uh, minus the uh, Linux part and uh, Javelin. Let me look at. Okay, where was I? Ah, yes, Javelin recipe. Yes. Javelin is the starting uh, weapon of your of our Terraform craft journey. Okay. Let's continue. Okay, I usually do things like that. Uh, things like great tech, things like uh, open source stuff, etc. etc. I decide to start a another Let's Play channel, but it's focused on English this time. So I do the same Minecraft content, but in English. I will try to edit them a bit. I'm not a good editor. I kind of suck <laughs> at editing. Uh, my usual motto is, if it's good enough, I, I can live with it. So it's also a bit challenge for me, a new challenge for me. Also, I, even though I exclusive, exclusively talk in, in English on my daily work, it's still just a work-related thing for me, and it's a bit a bit brand new challenge for me about that area. Okay, and I actually wanted to restart with the. Great take new horizons, but I just need to first focus on uh, start with something simpler. So, what is simple? Terraform Minecraft. So I looked at the Terraform Minecraft mod packs and decided this is good. Uh, also, Terraform Minecraft is kind of the best fit, but I actually want. A bit more detailed. I, I want a bit more detailed look. Uh, I kind of want to focus on the decorating stuff and kind of things like that. So I decide just modify it. Okay, well, let me come back when it's down. Okay, it's almost down. Okay, where was I? Ah, yes. Uh, like I said, I was planning on starting. Uh, r actually, re want to restart its Great Eight New Horizons. Because I kind of, I actually like it. Uh, I but I first wanted to do something simpler for the, especially for the English channel and. Is decided on Terraformer Craft. I actually quite enjoy Terraformer Craft too. It's really fun. And and by the way, you kind of save the logs as this. Okay, it's a simpler experience. Uh, Terraformer Craft is, even though it's. Uh, not harder uh, compared to vanilla Minecraft. It's a much more simpler and easier experience. Not easy, actually. Not easier is not the right word. It's a simpler experience. You just do some things like a caveman, <laughs> and you have fun while doing it. Okay. What is the main purpose of, of this series? Just have fun. And... Let's uh, also get to know each other. One more thing is... I will do... 
a lot of strange things. <laughs> I will ramble a bit. I will not so, uh, talk much or I will talk too much, etc, etc. You'll get used to it. Uh, my Turkish viewers are really used to it, I think. Uh, I might, I sometimes be kind of be annoying to watch. And there's a zombie. Actually, yes, let's get the monster on for achievements. Why not? Also, Terraforma Cup is most kind of a, uh, a different experience, a different kind of survival experience, and different kind of kind of building experience. Because first, you have gravity. <laughs> yes, uh, you cannot. Uh, most of the natural blocks are not floating like uh, like they do in the um, vanilla Minecraft. And I think this place might be a source of clay. Let me check. No, it's Liliac. What was... Yeah, they, they should be... Indicator... Ah, yes. Really. I need to find one of those... Uh, flowers. Because I need clay. For starting. <laughs> clay is quite important. And let me just clear here. Because... I will need some farming area. Yes. Okay. Hey, I think it's a good start. Onion. What? Yeah, hydration is too high. Hydration good. Too high. Okay, you don't like hydration. Got it. Okay. Now, rye. Rye seeds. You also don't like hydration water much. Good, good. Okay. We... We plant our first seeds, and they will grow. They will grow really slow. But they will grow. Uh, well, that's also one of the things that uh, Terraforma Craft changed compared to the vanilla Minecrafts. The plants go uh, grow slowly. But also, plants need some seasonal information, some temperature information, some humidity, etc., etc. So... Yeah, uh, farming is a mo lot more challenging compared to the vanilla Minecraft. Actually, when the Minecraft, you just put a source water block and go bada bim bada boom. You just hold some stuff and yeah, you have farm. A really good functioning farm, but in Terraform Minecraft, it's much more nuanced. Too. Also, in Terraform Minecraft, uh, general. Mining, etc. Also, a lot different. For example, and ah, oh, chromite we found. But I currently don't need chrome, so and I have a limited inventory space, so I will leave the chrome here. I just put waypoint. I put waypoints there because the small ores around the surface indicates there is a ore vein related to that ore underneath it. So, uh, by the way, Terraformacraft ore veins kind of similar to Great Tech ore veins, if you are familiar with uh, Great Tech. They are, they both ore veins, real ore veins. They are uh, bigger and you need to, you, you might need 
need to have several rounds. Oh, nice. It's a river. Uh, you might need several rounds to fully mine it. Actually, in starters, uh, you don't mine fully. Uh, so it's actually quite... Oh, yes, clay. I found clay. That's one of the most important starter resources. And, uh, as you can see, there are tables. Okay. Clay is quite important for starters, because a lot of uh, basic items made with clay. You... You hand, handle things with clay, and actually your basic storage for start is entirely clay. Based. Uh, your... Everything is clay based. And yeah, you, clay is your entire life for start. So, you will need a lot of clay. As you can see. And let me just har harvest those clays for a bit. And I come back with a turkey. Okay, <laughs> as a Turkish person, uh, this joke kind kind of felt right and wrong at the same time. Okay, what we need first? Let's look at an umpire. Uh, what are things? What are things that we need for umpire? Okay, we first need umpire vessel. And then we need large vessel. Actually, large vessel is later. We, need, we first need a vessel. Uh, ingot mold, pickaxe mold, and axe mold. Those are my first thing. Okay, let's look at vessel. Vessel is easy. Yes. Pickaxe. Ingot. And... Actually, salt. I need salt first. Yes. I also can use for a few more things like chisel, which is just stick. <laughs> and hammer. Like a like like a wise man said before. Hammer time. Hand. Oh no, I messed up. Okay. I think I have everything I need. I just need some straws and... Uh, where's my knife? Ah, yes, I broke my knife. I will need a lot of straw, so... Oh, tomato! actually quite good. Uh, ferns, I don't need you. Let's... One. And two. Yes. First, I need to... Yes. And then here, I'm putting them with V key, and let's put eight straws for each. And we need 
in total 16 logs. Yes. And we just need to start some fire. So, again, arson. Yes. And it will take around 8 minutes and then we have more co uh, our pots. Yeah. Uh, let's come back in... I don't need those. <coughs> let's come back in 8 minutes. And then after we can fin finish the episode. And we are back. Uh, as you can see, our things got sorted. And it's too hot to open now. Okay, uh, let's let them just cool a bit. Also, during th during that time, I search for more copper. Um, this is copper. This turns into copper, and we also we have tetrahedrate. It's also copper. Okay, why we need copper? It's actually our starter uh, metal. We need copper to do basically everything. And we have some pigs. I'm not going to kill them yet. I actually want to start a farm. So in the start, I I will probably be a, a bit vegetarian. It sounds not me, but <laughs> I will. I will be a vegetarian. Okay. Let's do this first. Actually, no. You get there and our pan. The pan is actually a good way to start with basic things. Uh, basic thing yes, as how can I say? Uh, by the way, we need to do first these two a large vessel. Yes, I will create a two large vessels because these these two will be our starter uh, chests, and we can do only one at a time. Okay, large vessels are actually like this, but they need to be put on the ground. So, they act more like chests, but they also have sealing ability, so they... Uh, as you can see, yeah, uh, my tomatoes are expiring quite soon. Okay, uh, onions have a real longer shelf life. Okay, good. Good to know. Let's eat tomatoes first. Okay. They have ability to store foods and... At least uh, make them last longer. What can I do with tomatoes? Oh, I can do salsa. I can do pizza. So I can do soup. That's good, actually. And I can do sandwiches. I can do taco. I can do... Uh, my main purpose will be making pizza with them. <laughs> okay. So, let's uh, talk about making ingots. Our starter ingots. I will not do them that now because uh, the episode is going to be finished. But let's say it's same procedure as them. Uh, but it has a one more important stuff. Uh, what I need first is pickaxe and yeah, those two. Okay, uh, also 
umpires. Uh, it's hammer mold, chisel mold for mold. Show it. Actually, I <coughs> I need hammer too, but it's later. Uh, I will first need to. Actually, let's do. Uh, yeah, I already have hammer mold. Hammer mold. Four mold. It's not urgent. Shovel is not also urgent. Axe is not urgent. Uh, Saw kind of feels say same role as shovel. Sword is not urgent. I can handle its javelin, mace, etc., etc. So yeah, those two are ah ball. I kind of use ball and jug. Jug is important. Okay, let's do jug first. Yes. Jug and... Actually, spindle is kind of important too. Because it's... Yeah. But balls... Actually, balls are not that important. Actually, it's it's helpful because I can. Soups are kind of good with uh, not just nutrition value, but also with. Oh, hello. Uh, I, if I was you, I wouldn't stay because you would, you would work. Okay, also I need a lot more logs, so I will. I won't start this now because I need to access it really fast. I need to pour it really fast, and so we are about to finish our episode. So, let's finish it. Uh, I need to find a <laughs> English way of uh, finishing my episode. So let's say let's meet later.